So in this lesson, we will be solving algebraic equations with grouping symbols. For example, 8 minus 3, 1 plus 3x equals minus 4. You can solve this equation either by using balance method or by using the reversing method. So there are four essential steps for any of these methods. So the first step is to open these brackets. To open the brackets and then what you do, you take all the terms having the variable to the left hand side and all numbers to the right hand side of the equation. So first you open the bracket. So you will get 8 minus 3. 3 multiplied by 1 is 3. Then 3 multiplied by 3x minus 3 multiplied by plus 3x is minus 9x equals minus 4. So now you keep this step on the left hand side because it has x so minus 9x and in order to remove this 8 this is plus 8 so you add minus 8 using the balance method I have already explained the balance method so minus 3 so you add plus 3 so you have done two things extra here plus 3 and minus 8 so we will do these things on the right hand side to balance the equation. So minus 4 minus 8 plus 3. The terms which we added on the left hand side we also add on the right hand side. So this will lead us to minus 9x equals these terms will be cancelled. Minus 4 and minus 8 are minus 12 plus 3 is minus 9. So the next step is to isolate the variable on the left hand side. So we have done the first step. So we didn't need first step in this equation because there was no variable term. But we have done this step. We have, we have eliminated all the numbers from the left hand side. So eliminate all the numbers from the left hand side. So we have done this. And now in the final step isolate x. So in order to isolate x just we have to divide this by minus 9 so therefore we have to divide the same on the other hand side and this will be cancel out and x equals 1 so this was if we are using the balance method now if we are using the reversing method the steps are essentially the same this is preferable that you perform only one step at a time but in reversing method we don't do this balancing thing what we do is we take these things to the other end other side of the equation by changing this with their additive inverse and additive inverse of 8 would be minus 8 additive inverse of minus 3 would be 3 so we will remove from this side and we will add additive inverse on the other hand side so this is what we do in reversing method so the steps are essentially same use the distributive property to eliminate the parentheses, this is distributive property, open the brackets, the same step as we do with this, the same step is being done here. Now instead of eliminating, we are taking the terms, all the variables to the right hand side. So we take all terms having variables from left hand side to right hand side. And all variables so we take all numbers from left hand side to right hand side because we need our end result to be something like this x equals 1 so our variable should be on the left hand side and number on the right hand side numbers the value of the variable so this is what we not want so the same thing instead of eliminating we are now taking the numbers to the right hand side and taking the variables to the left hand side if if there are some variables on the right hand side 
we will be doing an example in which variables will be on both sides of the equations. But for this equation, let's do it in using the reversing method. So the steps will be like this. 8 minus 3 minus 9x, we are just opening the parentheses, equals minus 4. The first step is exactly the same. Now instead of balancing, we just take this 8 to the other hand other side of the bracket so we only keep minus 9x on this side so minus 9x equals minus 4 when this 8 goes on the other side it becomes minus 8 and this minus 3 goes on the other side if you want to do the only one step at a time you can leave it like this and you can keep minus 3 here then in the next step minus 3 minus 9x equals minus 12 in the next step, you take this to the other end, other side of the equation and it will be plus 3. So minus 9x equals minus 12 plus 3, which equals minus 9, minus 9x equals 9. And now in reversing method, if something is being multiplied on the left hand side, we divide it on the other, end, other side of the equation. So x and we take this minus 9 to the other side of the equation and it will be divided and x will be 1 because this will cancel out. So you can use any of these methods very simple essentially the steps are same. So now we will do quickly few examples and without any further explanation of the methods I will just do few examples.